anyone who writes wonders at some point, what am I supposed to do with all of this paper? If I don't use this idea in an essay, why am I doing this? If this writing exercise doesn't fit within the parameters of my project, why am I wasting my time? There's a fantastic writing teacher who, if you haven't heard of her, you should check out her books. She calls the process of writing composting. As Ms. Goldberg writes, our senses by themselves are dumb. They take an experience, but they need the richness of sifting for a while through our consciousness and through our whole bodies. I call this composting. Our bodies are garbage heaps. We collect experience, and from the decomposition of the thrown out eggshells, spinach leaves, coffee grinds, and old steak bones of our mind, come the nitrogen, heat, and very fertile soil. Out of this fertile soil bloom our poems and stories, but this does not come all at once. It takes time. Continue to turn over and over the organic details of your life until some of them fall through the garbage of discursive thoughts to the solid ground of black soil. I personally don't think that there is any waste per se with our writing. I think our ideas are riddles and we're trying different combinations to see if we can solve them. We can get it half right or get the shading but not the line or perhaps a few of the pearls but not the necklace. Rubber, penicillin, and the pacemakers all came out of accidental experiments. It is the process of trying over and over again that leads to discovery.